Good evening, Americans. This is your favorite alien on the afternoon of uh, Thursday, December 14th, 2023. Here we are getting towards the end of the season of Christmas. And I want to do a commentary on senior citizens, the forgotten. And senior citizens and life insurance. Everybody seems to use the senior citizens as a scapegoat or pawns for whatever they want. Okay. And today's commentary is kind of tough because there was a guy that was a good guy, but he was associated with this kind of stuff, and it kind of hurts to have to mention his name with the life insurance. Today on TV, you see all kinds of senior citizens' life insurance. The original creator of this is Colonial Penn, and their $9.95 life insurance with Alex Trebek for a decade, and other people that have come in since Bergeron is now there, it's a bonanza for advertising. It's it's a big bonanza. I don't know how much they pay to Alex Trebek, or they're paying Bergeron, or the other actors that are doing this. But it's a disgrace to senior citizens. Okay? Because it says, the three P's, price, price, and price. Yeah, well, let's talk about the price. Nine ninety-five a unit. Most of you people who don't understand life insurance don't know what a unit is. Okay, you buy life insurance, say, uh, $100,000 for $21 or $500,000 and you're paying $60 a month for $500,000, maybe more than that, okay? Insurance is expensive. Life insurance specifically is expensive. But when you have senior citizens that are 60 and up, and they say 50 to 85, okay? Uh, yeah, well, why would you buy life insurance at 85? Specifically when, uh, say, you're 50 and they're saying, well, the older you get, the less you get, okay? So let's say that you're 50 and they start you at $1,000 for nine ninety five, And you want $10,000. That'll cost you $99, $100, people, for $10,000. A hundred dollars. When people are paying five hundred thousand dollars for what, uh, let's say whole term or term life insurance, uh, five hundred thousand for fifty eight dollars or fifty dollars, and you're paying ten thousand, you're paying a hundred dollars a month. For 10000 of coverage. See, because every $1,000, and that's if you're 50. If you're older than that, I'm 64, so I, I should have called and find out how much 64 is. My wife, who passed away at age 77 two years ago, when she was 70, she asked me to call. And I did. Alex Trebek was still around as the pitch man for... Colonial Pen and I called him. Oh, it's nine hundred dollars for her per nine ninety five. Nine hundred dollars, people. So if she wanted ten thousand or a thousand dollars, you know, ten thousand, that would be a hundred dollars, a little over a hundred dollars. Wow for an individual at 70 years old. 
So imagine if she paid $100 a month, 10 uh, for uh, a year, so that's $1,200, and she lived seven years. So she paid them. What would you say? Uh, Fourteen, eight thousand four hundred dollars for a measly nine hundred dollars. You see what I mean? And there's other insurance companies that are that way. You have to find out what the base price is and how much they're covering with the base price. And I'm not just signaling out Colonial Pen. There's other senior citizen insurance companies that are starting to do that. Physicians Mutual is getting into the fact, too. But there's, you know, other senior citizen companies that you see on TV that do this. It's not only, it's not a uh, Colonial Pen uh, club, exclusive club anymore, but it was back then. It was exclusively Colonial Pen for the most part that did this. And the other companies found out, what a market did they have in there? Yeah, okay, and now they're starting to saturate the market. But to you senior citizens who have Colonial Pen, really, is it worth, say, you were buying today, and what's the going price for a 50-year-old? Is it still $1,000? Or a 70-year-old, it's to, if it's still 9 or is it down to $800? How much is it for an 80-year-old? $700? For a base price, nine ninety-five. dollars Oh, we won't change your, your uh, coverage and we won't change your price. It depends on when you get it. If you get it at 50, well, you pay this much. If you get it at 80, you pay this much for less coverage than you're getting at 50. Really? 9.95. Well, you see how much that 9.95 is getting the company there. They're paying out more than the individual is covered for. And what happens when you reach the age and then do you get the money back? They don't say that on their TV. It's price, 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 and return. But you don't see that in the commercials, do you? This is your favorite alien saying, just a commentary on the prices of insurance for senior citizens. Life insurance. Good day.